Hepatitis B is a viral infection that affects millions of people worldwide. It is caused by the hepatitis B virus, HBV, which attacks the liver and can lead to severe liver damage, liver cancer, and even death. Fortunately, medical science has come a long way in the treatment of this disease. One of the most promising drugs in the fight against hepatitis B is lamivudine. This antiviral medication has revolutionized hepatitis B treatment and is helping patients to manage their symptoms and live a normal life. In this video, we will explore what lamivudine is, how it works, and the benefits it offers to those living with hepatitis B. We will also discuss the potential side effects and how this medication is changing the landscape of hepatitis B treatment. So, whether you're a patient, caregiver, or healthcare professional, read on to discover the incredible impact of lamivudine on the lives of those with hepatitis B. What is hepatitis B? Hepatitis B is a serious viral infection that affects the liver. It is caused by the hepatitis B virus, HBV, which is transmitted through bodily fluids, such as blood, semen, and vaginal secretions. HBV can be spread through sexual contact, sharing needles or other injection drug equipment, and from mother to child during childbirth. Hepatitis B is a silent killer, as it often has no symptoms in its early stages. But over time, it can cause liver damage, liver cancer, and even death. There are different types of hepatitis B infections, including acute and chronic. Acute hepatitis B infection lasts for six months or less, and most people recover from it without any complications. However, some people develop chronic hepatitis B infection, which lasts for more than six months. Chronic hepatitis B infection can cause serious liver damage and increase the risk of liver cancer. Treatment is necessary to manage the symptoms and prevent complications. How Lamivudine Works in Treating Hepatitis B Lamivudine is an antiviral medication that works by blocking the replication of the hepatitis B virus, HBV. It is a nucleoside analog reverse transcriptase inhibitor, NRTI, that interferes with the virus's ability to replicate its DNA. By doing so, lamivudine reduces the amount of virus in the patient's blood, which helps to slow down the progression of the disease. Lamivudine is effective against both acute and chronic hepatitis B infections. It has been shown to reduce the risk of liver damage, liver cancer, and death associated with chronic hepatitis B infection. It is also effective in preventing mother-to-child transmission of HBV during childbirth. Benefits of using lamivudine as a treatment option Lamivudine is a highly effective treatment option for hepatitis B. It has several benefits that make it a popular choice for patients and healthcare professionals alike. Firstly, lamivudine is easy to administer. It is available in tablet form, which can be taken orally once a day. This makes it a convenient option for patients who prefer to take their medication at home. Secondly, lamivudine has a high success rate in reducing the amount of virus in the blood. This helps to slow down the progression of the disease and prevent complications such as liver damage and liver cancer. Thirdly, lamivudine has a good safety profile. It is generally well tolerated by patients, with few side effects. This makes it a suitable treatment option for patients who cannot tolerate other antiviral medications. Lastly, lamivudine is cost-effective. It is available as a generic medication, which makes it more affordable than other antiviral medications for hepatitis B. Lamivudine Dosage and Administration The recommended dose of lamivudine for the treatment of hepatitis B is 100 mg once a day for adults and children weighing more than 30 kg. For children weighing less than 30 kg, the dose is based on body weight. Lamivudine should be taken orally with or without food. It is important to take the medication at the same time every day to maintain a consistent level of the drug in the blood. Possible Side Effects of Lamivudine Like all medications, lamivudine can cause side effects. However, most patients tolerate the medication well, and the side effects are usually mild and temporary. The most common side effects of lamivudine include headache, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, fatigue, and muscle aches. These side effects usually go away on their own within a few days or weeks. In rare cases, lamivudine can cause more serious side effects, such as liver damage, lactic acidosis, and pancreatitis. Patients should seek medical attention immediately if they experience any symptoms of these side effects, such as yellowing of the skin or eyes, abdominal pain, or persistent nausea and vomiting. Precautions and warnings when taking lamivudine. Patients should inform their healthcare provider if they have any allergies, medical conditions, or are taking any other medications before starting lamivudine. Lamivudine can interact with other medications, including those used to treat HIV and other viral infections. Patients should inform their healthcare provider if they are taking any other medications before starting lamivudine. 
Lamivudine can cause lactic acidosis, a serious condition that can be fatal. Patients should inform their healthcare provider if they experience any symptoms of lactic acidosis, such as muscle weakness, difficulty breathing, or abdominal pain. Comparison of lamivudine with other antiviral medications for hepatitis B treatment. There are several other antiviral medications available for the treatment of hepatitis B, including entecavir, tenofovir, and adafavir. Each medication has its own unique benefits and side effects. Compared to entecavir, lamivudine is less potent but more affordable. Lamivudine is also more effective in preventing mother-to-child transmission of HBV during childbirth. Compared to tenofovir, lamivudine is less potent but has a better safety profile. Tenofovir can cause kidney damage, while lamivudine has a lower risk of causing kidney problems. Compared to adafavir, lamivudine is less potent but has fewer side effects. Adafavir can cause kidney damage, bone loss, and lactic acidosis, while lamivudine has a lower risk of causing these side effects. Future Prospects and Ongoing Research on Lamivudine Lamivudine has been in use for over two decades and has proven to be a highly effective treatment option for hepatitis B. However, ongoing research is being conducted to explore new ways to improve the efficacy of lamivudine and other antiviral medications for hepatitis B. One area of research is the use of combination therapy, where two or more antiviral medications are used together to increase efficacy and reduce the risk of drug resistance. Another area of research is the development of new drugs that target different stages of the HBV life cycle. These drugs may be used in combination with lamivudine or other antiviral medications to improve treatment outcomes. Conclusion Lamivudine is a highly effective treatment option for hepatitis B. It works by blocking the replication of the hepatitis B virus, reducing the amount of virus in the blood, and slowing down the progression of the disease. Lamivudine has several benefits, including ease of administration, high success rate, good safety profile, and cost effectiveness. It is also effective in preventing mother-to-child transmission of HBV during childbirth. While lamivudine has a good safety profile, patients should be aware of the possible side effects and precautions when taking the medication. Patients should also inform their healthcare provider if they are taking any other medications to avoid drug interactions. Ongoing research is being conducted to improve the efficacy of lamivudine and other antiviral medications for hepatitis B combination therapy and the development of new drugs are areas of focus. In conclusion, lamivudine has revolutionized hepatitis B treatment and is helping patients to manage their symptoms and live a normal life. It is a promising drug in the fight against hepatitis B, and ongoing research is expected to improve treatment outcomes even further. Thanks for watching.